morning, bon dia. I am on my way to Sao Paulo. My boyfriend is driving and I am taking you through the whole day. I'm gonna show you what I eat in a day while traveling and also what I spend in a day while traveling in Brazil. We're starting with breakfast. You know, I like to have my two breakfasts in the morning. If you see my morning routine, I have a very like, set morning routine. I always have two breakfasts, but today we're traveling. So we're taking it more lightly. I have a natural way protein shake. This is banana flavored, if I understand Portuguese correctly, but banana should be banana. And water. I bought this from the grocery store a few days ago, so you will see the cost here somewhere. Cheers. It's solid, it's good. stopped to go to the bathroom but there was a Starbucks nearby so you know I had to I had to we have like a pistachio latte pistachio frappuccino and pistachio ice latte and they all sounded very good but I tr but I took the pistachio latte so let's try it yeah, it's so warm it's good it's good it burns your tongue slightly <laughs> But from my god. Brazilian streets scare me. We are in the middle of trucks here. But this is good. So I paid $29.50 for the latte and also for this. This is a chicken coxinha? Coxinha. Coxinha. Good. De franco. Coxinha de frango. Coxinha de frango. It's like a salty donut in a different shape with chicken inside. It's good. sparkling water and they gave me this. It looks super cute. Okay. It's literally just sparkling water, but the packaging is fancy. I like it. How much chicken in this is actually insane. Like, look at this. We just got to our hotel. I will talk about that expense in a second, but first. We got the goods. When I first came to Brazil, I think it was the second day, like the, the first time we actually like went out to eat something, to have a snack somewhere, only the two of us. We went to this place where they have like acai bowls and I grabbed something that I didn't think would be so good, but it was amazing. This is avocado cream. It's green. <laughs> it is so good. I bought 500 milliliters of this thing and bananas. Let's try it. Look at it. Hmm. So. Good. It's the same as last year. It's the same as last year. It's it's so hard to explain. It's like guacamole, but sweet. For sure there's like a huge amount of sugar in this or sweetener or I have no clue what is in, in, in this. This is amazing. Let's try the combination of it out. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Very good. It's amazing. I took a shower and got ready to go. Before I leave, let's talk about the hotel room. We are staying at Ibis in Morumbi. It's right across the shopping center, so, you know, that's good. The room is 274.05. So that divided by two, 137.025 reais for one night per person. It's a very basic room, like you have everything you need um and that's about it <laughs> there's a bathroom but the view is extremely nice like we are on the 20th floor and look at this that is a beautiful skyline now let's go Last night we went to the mall and then we went to visit some of my boyfriend's friends. They cooked for us, which was very nice, so that was no expense. And also the cooking was really good, so... So I did purchase a few things at the mall yesterday. First of all, I went to the pharmacy. I got pain relief, medicine and tampons. I think that's very self-explanatory. It was 117 reais. Um, it's 20 euros. Let me check. That is 21 euros and 38 cents. Then we went to a grocery store and we bought a bottle of wine to bring to those friends. To not show up empty handed, to have a nice gift for them. And we also bought water just to drink it. And I bought these things. I bought two of them. They seem really interesting. It's like a drink mix. Like you just add the alcohol to it and it makes like a drink. And the total for everything was 97.88, which we're gonna split by two. It will be 48.94 for my part. Next, I bought underwear. There's nothing more to say about that. It's just basic underwear. Next, I went into like a cosmetic shop, kind of like a body shop. Uh, it's called O Boticario Lab. It's this one. It was a very cute shop, like. It smelled amazing in there. It was like, they just had like really nice products. I bought a matcha face mask and Brazilian soap. <laughs> and the total for that was 62.8 reais. Parked in the hotel garage and it was 40 reais, so 15 per person. Graham Stefan would be proud of me. Remember yesterday's um, acai place bowl thingy avocado cream? I'm eating it for breakfast because I still have most of it left and I need to get breakfast anyway. So might as well eat it for breakfast. Cause I gotta say, you're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, baby Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of it Baby 
baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe and right away I saw my We are in the car on the way back from Sao Paulo. Let's catch up on the expenses. My boyfriend is driving, don't vlog and drive. So I got Starbucks, again. We decided not to pay for the breakfast at the hotel. We just decided to grab some coffee and take it on the go while walking through the shopping mall. Then for lunch, we went to a pokey place that was 11.38 euros, which is 62.4 reais. Honestly, I was a bit surprised by the price. It's exactly the same price as in Vienna, and Vienna generally is way more expensive than Brazil, but it was like a pokey place in a financial district, so I guess that kind of explains the price. Then I purchased this, not the phone, <laughs> the phone case. Uh, it is very original, you know, it was a random store on the side of the street. I paid 7 euros and 40 cents for it, which was 40 reais. Then I got another Starbucks. I have something to say about this. Starbucks here is way cheaper than Starbucks in Europe. It is like half of the price. If I buy Starbucks here, then I'm maybe like my needs will be satisfied and I won't buy Starbucks in Europe. That's a money-saving hack. I'm joking. My second Starbucks of the day was a tall cold brew with milk and it was 17.5 reais, which is 3 euros and 19 cents. When I tell you in Vienna, I might be able to get an espresso for 3 euros. That's all. We also put some gas into the car for 70 reais, so that is 45 each. No, that's wrong. That is 35 each. There are two more expenses that I haven't added yet. First of all, I bought a gift from Top and stock, two coffee cups, an espresso cup and a coffee cup actually. Bought two basic tops and one was 39.90, so for the two of them it was 79.80. Let's start with the highest expense, which was shopping actually. I spent 277 reais. I do have to say 117 of those was just healthcare products. I spent 267 reais for food, which is about 48 euros. That is a lot for 24 hours, but I am traveling, so I think this is kind of a normal expense. The last expense was gifts. I spent 173 reais on gifts, which is about 31 euros. What I spent for a trip to Sao Paulo in about 24 hours was 902 reais, which is about 163 euros. That is a lot for 24 hours. I think it's worth it for me to spend money on travel and on experiences. So I am so grateful to be able to travel and to be able to spend money on making memories. 